Notre Dame's campus, home of the Golden Dome, and now so is one man's head. One Irish fan took his love for the dome and focused that love on his own. ABC 57's Daryl Bajoris was on double duty tonight and has a look at this man's ink. For fighting Irish football fan Tracy Moore, nine hours under the needle was a small price to pay for his favorite team. It was painful. I can't say it didn't hurt because it did. Moore is one of many to walk through the doors of Michiana Tattoo Emporium this year, but the only one to get inked on his head. It was just brought up, you know, I can do the dome, and I said, well, how about on my head? Because I always keep my head shaved anyway, so it's just, just it was a unique place to do it. Most of the time, people want something different. Artist Brandon Hunt worked on several sketches before coming up with Moore's final design. Looking at Notre Dame, the building itself, and making sure all the details were in there, so that way it could be distinctive as Notre Dame. He's drawn more fighting Irish-themed tattoos this year than Michigan wants, something that's a rarity, even during a winning season. If Notre Dame can keep it up, Hunt expects even busier times ahead. I'd probably be adding a lot, a lot of dates in there as far as this year. And maybe their uh, their record being 12 and 0, 13 and 0. <laughs> but even if the Irish can't stay perfect, Moore says his tattoo will always be a winner with the crowds. It's been great. I have pictures taken all over the place. If I had money for every picture taken, I'd be rich.